guys, how's it going? It's Hyde here, and we're back with a brand new episode of Vectorio. And in the last episode, we maxed out our heat here. We made our first gremlin. We also made a few other things. We made these cannons. The cannons are okay. The rocket pods were not good. Do not recommend the rocket pods. But here we are. We've got a bunch of money saved up. I'm trying to save up some more purple or essence or whatever. So that we can build some more of these gremlins. Because I think they're going to be my primary defense against the new boss. Now, how do we want to do this? I think I'm going to be able to get rid of... A bunch of guns. At least I'm hoping I'll be able to. These things don't have a heat? Or do they? It's only 150 heat. Okay, so I should be able to stick one of these down as a replacement. I want to get rid of a bunch of cannons and a bunch of guns and hopefully save up enough stuff so that we're able to build a whole bunch of gremlins I don't think we necessarily need as many guns as we're showing right now. If I can get rid of 80% of them, I'll be feeling pretty good. Maybe even a little bit more than that. I don't know. We'll have to see. Let's see how many we can get rid of. For each one, though, it takes a thousand iridium so we probably want to start expanding our iridium supply i don't know we may as well just just go ham it's gonna cost a lot of money but it's gonna be worth it so let's just take a look here what's this gonna cost us 7.45 million gold and then we will have a whole ton of iridium coming in. That's not bad. I think I'm going to have to get rid of some stuff. I don't know if we have enough heat room for all of those. So we'll just, I'll just start deleting some stuff here and there. We'll see how it goes. Hopefully we can make it work. All right, guys, so I've done the same thing that we've been doing. I made a strip of these things. Uh-oh. I forgot to put walls. I forgot to put walls. That is going to end up being a little bit of a problem. We just got to stop those little fast speedy guys from just coming in here and wrecking these things. Anyway, we've got our strip of the heat things the radiators whatever the heck they're called i should probably stick some defenses on these things just to help defend them a little bit i don't know i'll do it at least it'll help a little bit but yeah so we're trying to work up enough resources here it's fifty thousand purple to make one of those guys once we have it, I think we're just going to wing it and see what happens. These orange things are really, really good. But they're kind of expensive. And it's a little slow to make them, so I'm not sure. Ah, oh, crap. Look it. Look it, my guns aren't here. I got nothing to defend my walls. Alright, where the heck are my guns? Why aren't they coming? They should be. Anyway, it's fine. These, what I was saying was, these orange guys are really expensive. 50,000 essence for one of them is a lot. And really, that's the only thing that is taking forever. Other than that, the, the gold's coming in pretty fast. The iridium's coming in pretty fast now as well. Oh my god, where are my... Where are my guns? Let's go defense. Will that help build the guns? What's going on here? Why won't you build guns? Just build them. Here, here they come. I don't know. I've got 4,000 heat left. Not sure why it's not building the guns faster. 
Come on. Put those guns down. Put them down. There we go. That'll help. Oh, that's going to be very good. Okay, so these ones are basically sacrificial. They're just going to get destroyed. I don't really care about them. I should build some extra robo ports to help me build stuff faster. That will allow me to plunk stuff down a little bit quicker, I hope. Should be fine. Let's do something like that for now. That'll get us going. And I am just going to wait. We're almost there, actually, to get this last red guy or orange guy, whatever, the gremlin. Almost got that guy. And then I guess it's going to be time to just do it and see what happens. I should probably... I should probably fill up the rest of our heat, whatever we can. So maybe I'll just make a strip of guns like this. These guns aren't the best, but actually, you know what? Let me cancel that. What? What about these Tesla towers? They go pretty far and they're a little bit more affordable. Maybe we'll put down a few of those. That's looking pretty good. I think they take a little bit less purple. Yeah, it's only 2.5 thousand, which is much easier to achieve. Yeah, I think this is going to look much better. Look at that. We've already got our first one. I don't know if it's going to be able to start shooting. It's supposed to slow it as well. So that might come in handy. We'll have to see how it goes, but let's just wait a little bit longer finish building up all these resources once it's done we'll just go in and fight that atlas see what's happening i can't wait i think that's pretty much the only mission we have left building defeat the atlas third guardian and super weapon defeat the atlas so the atlas is the boss that we're going to be about to fight oh i can't wait it's going to be great okay guys stay tuned be right back all right, guys, we're back up to maximum heat. There's nothing else we can do. I have come in here. I have increased our damage output to 1.7 times the regular. I have also increased our bullet boost by one time, which I think means all of my cannons are able to shoot or all my guns are able to shoot twice as much. So I think it's actually shooting two bullets for every one. It definitely is. So we're basically doing four times as much damage because I'm shooting twice as much bullets for almost twice as much damage. So th these guys here are just pumping out the damage now. It's, it's gonna be a mess. It's gonna be a mess. So I can't wait to see this thing. Let's just do it. Let's get into this. Oh, we're going to be allowed a whole bunch of extra heat here right away, I think. I should have maybe saved before we got into this, but it's too late now. I don't know what happened to my HUD also. My HUD seems to have disappeared. Where is this stupid thing? That should allow us to have a little bit more heat if, if the HUD ever returns. There we go. So let's increased my heat again we're allowed to have a little bit more room which should allow us to get more weapons why is this not working oh my god that thing is way bigger than i thought it was going to be i might actually stick oh i'm gonna need a new tower over here and then i might stick another gremlin up higher because we're going to have to break this one at some point. Oh my god, why is it going up that way? Mm, it's not exactly what we wanted. But let's see. Hopefully our towers can kill it. What I do have to do is make sure I destroy these things before it does. Okay, here we go. Oh, it's getting lit up. Okay, before it hits, I gotta destroy them myself. Oh. I was afraid that was gonna happen. 
it's not looking too good. Just keep it going. A quarter of the life is gone. I need these other gremlins to be built. Why aren't they working? Defense, go, go, go. Okay, I added extra towers here. So when this one breaks, it shouldn't have too much of an impact. Oh boy. Okay, that guy is gonna get mad. Let's slap down a few more of these if we can. I think we're gonna be okay. We still have a bit of room to go. Oh yeah, we're gonna be fine. Easy peasy. Look at that gunship port. The trident. What does this cost? One million gold. The first super weapon fires huge beams of high concentrated energy that pierce through anything it touches. Only one per world. What's the range on this thing? Range of zero. Damage 150,000? What? But what's the range of zero thing? That seems wrong. I mean, we could put one down just to see what it does. It costs 1 million gold, which we can just plunk down. Why can't I plunk it down? There it goes. Uh, it also costs... A thousand... 1,750 iridium? No, no, no. We'll get rid of that. There we go. Why is that not building? I have something else in queue... And I don't know what it is. Also... We've reached the border? Uh-oh. We got a big wave coming from down there. Okay, hopefully that's not too much of an issue. We'll see what happens. I can turn a bunch of this stuff off now. We don't need all of this resources getting dumped into extra stats right now. Let's turn all these back off again. I actually don't know why this thing won't build. It's 1 million gold, right? Not 10 million. Yeah, 1 million. Zero essence, zero iridium, 1500 power, which we can easily accommodate. 800 heat, which is nothing. I'm not sure why. Oh, there it goes. The first super weapon. How do I tell it where to shoot? Can I control it somehow? Why does it say zero active? Can I build another one? What is this? Also, we can build a gunship port, which also costs a million. Only 50,000 essence. 2500 iridium, though. We can't actually hold all that yet, so we're gonna have to expand our iridium storage until we can hold all that i think it's gonna it's gonna take a minute cheapest last place last place how do i get them to build that stuff they should be able to just do it i've got tons of resources built up why aren't they doing it okay guys check it out we got up to 2600 storage that took forever but we did it i feel pretty good about this so now we can finally 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 make this gunship port deploys a fully automated gunship into your base to patrol around and fire at enemies i it just sounds so cool we have to check it out okay so i need a million gold five fifty thousand essence which is not a problem 1500 power, which is not a problem. 2500 iridium, which we now have. And 800 heat, which is definitely not a problem. Okay, so there we go. We can put that thing down. We just gotta wait for another 50,000 gold. Uh, 500,000 gold, rather. 
I still have no idea how to use this thing. I don't know if I have to tell it where to shoot or it's not really giving me any information. The first super weapon fires huge beams of high concentrated energy that pierce through anything it touches range of zero. So I don't know if we just have to put this somewhere that it's just gonna basically hit something or I don't know. I don't know. Maybe it, there's a bug with it because I feel like a range of zero is just not what it's supposed to be. It seems wrong. Temporarily disabled engineering. Okay. Well, anyway, we're almost at the gunship. That's basically all I want to see. And I think other than that, we've seen everything. This is the, I don't know what you want to call it, the early access version of the game. Basically, they are releasing a Victorio 2.0 soon. This is just the free demo, if you will. So I'm uh, expecting it's not going to be totally full of content. See, now this, this was supposed to be something we could tell where to go. And I don't know how we do that. Can also be set to patrol. What does it say? Can also be set to patrol a predetermined area. I don't know how to do that. But this thing is so cool. Oh, it just lights things up. That is awesome. It's kind of slow, though. It would be nice if we had a hundred of these things just scattered all over the place. Does it just track? It looked like it was trying to turn around and then it turned around again. I don't know. I kind of want to just build a hundred of these and see what it looks like. But I don't know if I have enough time in my life to do it. Maybe we'll leave it. We'll try it in the full release if it's a thing. We'll build a hundred of these things and we'll see how it goes. But guys, I hope you liked this series. I think that is going to wrap it up. I don't know if there's anything else for us to do really besides just like take over the world. And I mean, there's nothing else to do. So I don't know if that's going to be really worth it. I think we'll just wrap it up there. I hope you liked the series. If you did, don't forget to leave me a thumbs up on this video. Subscribe to my channel if you're new here. And I will see you next time.